Martina Mina is one of the world's most popular paranormal TikTok pages with over 1.3 million followers on the platform. Very little is known about Marion, the owner who runs this TikTok page, and it's believed that she's not living in a house that is haunted, but she in fact, is the one that is haunted. Mariam's TikTok journey began on the 20th of April 2021, and it was completely unrelated to the paranormal entirely. In fact, for the first year of Mariam's TikTok journey, it was completely unrelated to the paranormal entirely, instead focusing on her pregnancy, her family, and then her newborn baby. And then her first ever paranormal video was uploaded on the 23rd of August 2022. Say hello, Daddy! This video completely exploded, gaining over 20 million views and 1 million likes. And this was where Mariam's paranormal story began. Looking deeper into the comment section of this video though, people are rather skeptical of Mariam's decisions during the video. You were staring at the door the whole time, you knew it was gonna happen my love. Definitely staged. Why did she stand to the left so much? I don't know, it's you standing on the side so we can see the door perfectly that made me realise this has to be staged. This left a lot of people skeptical over Mariam's video, but the views, likes, and followers were coming in. She then uploads a follow-up video two days later, which is a skit of her leaving her haunted house. Finally leaving the ghost. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Showing that she's going to continue uploading the paranormal content on her page. And a few days later, yet another skit is uploaded to Mariam's page. Every time I hear a noise at night, On the surface, it just looks like Mariam is poking fun at her haunted house and the things that go on there. But some viewers pointed out a few things that were a little bit odd about the video. And on closer inspection, you can see a picture in the frame behind her moving on its own. Anyone else notice what happened in the back or is it just me? The photo moved at the back. Oh my god, the photo just moved at the back. The comment section enjoyed this video as the subtlety of it didn't come across as staged or potentially faked. It just happened as Mariam was trying to make a skit about her situation. But the paranormal activity in her house continues, and on the following day, Mariam uploads this paranormal video. ...from our cameras of what happened when we were not home. Oh my god, guys. I just came home and I find the uh, Mina blanket is down and the uh, things is on. So I'm gonna check the camera and we'll see what was happening here. Mariam claims that this video was captured on her security cameras that she has installed in her house to try and capture the strange activity that she had been claiming she'd been experiencing. The comment section at this point are starting to believe more and more of Mariam's claims. Why are you still living there? You need to get out of this house. There is something haunted, trust me. Some time passes and Mariam continues to upload paranormal content to her channel. One video in particular that does incredibly well racking up over 8 million views is this video where her and her son who is playing games are sat in their living room innocently. After jumping into the comments though, a lot of people are very, very skeptical of this video as they claim that when the curtain is moved, in the reflection of the window, you can see a person's face in the background who cannot be seen on the recording. This led people to believe that the person caught in the reflection was the person who was pulling off this paranormal activity. But on the other hand, this led a lot of people to believe that there was something else entirely with them that Mariam didn't see. And even though they had uploaded all of this paranormal evidence to their TikTok page, her husband still believes that they are not haunted and not living in a house that is active. That is until this video that was uploaded on the 31st of August 2022, where Mariam's husband is lying in bed and experiences something for himself. My husband didn't believe me that our house is haunted, and this happened. A few more 
more days pass and another popular video is uploaded by Marion, gaining over 8.5 million views. The video is of her with her baby sat on her lap eating food when they capture more than what they bargained for. It was Mina's first time to eat and watch what happened. She's getting... Once again though, after heading into the comments section, people are incredibly skeptical of this video as they claim they can see a string that is attached to Mariam's hair, which they believe to be the catalyst of what is pulling her hair up and not a spirit or entity that she claims for it to have been. I saw the string behind her when she said it was his first time. Who's gonna tell her? At least she tried. I saw the string, lol. Mariam's videos at this point have completely divided a community. Most people believing that what they are seeing is staged content as they can see things like reflections in windows and string on hair. And the rest of the people believing that what she is experiencing is completely legit and real. Another popular video that gained over 5 million views is uploaded by Mariam and once again draws a lot of skepticism to Mariam's claims. While her and her son are practicing boxing in their living room, they experience some strange activity that leaves them incredibly spooked and run away. But a lot of people noticed that on Mariam's face as she was running away, she was smiling, as if she already knew that this was going to happen. But once again, there were still some comments that believed that what Mariam was experiencing was real. But on the 11th of September 2022, a video was uploaded that completely baffled anybody that watched the video, from believers to non-believers. I can see something weird in the reflection on my TV. In the clip, Mariam can see a figure in her TV, but when she pans the camera over to the area where the figure would be, there's nothing there. And when she pans back, it reappears. After scanning through the comment section, people are divided once again, with a lot of people unsure of how Mariam could have pulled this kind of video off if it was faked. But there were also the disbelievers who claim to have seen the person who was squatting down out of shots whenever she pans the camera over to the area where they would have been stood. But regardless of the skepticism and the negativity that was aimed towards Mariam and her content, she continues to document the paranormal and strange activity within her house. With more and more popularity and more and more popular videos like this one, which reached over 14 million views. What the security camera is caught today. The comments section were less concerned about Mariam's welfare and more amazed at the actions that she took to take the bottle away. She already knew the ghost was there, she's very brave. She said, give me that bottle. Mother is not scared, she just grabs it. But it isn't until the 12th of September 2022 that Mariam believes she finds what could be causing the problems in her house. After hearing a lot of banging in the walls, she decides to have a little look into a vent. I heard something in the walls and decided to open a vent that's beside my bed. After opening it, we found something really scary and could possibly be the object that's causing all of this stuff in my house. Can anyone tell me what it says on the doll? When she pulls out the doll, it is covered in very strange writing. One of the top comments on the video deciphers what the writing means. It's in Tamil. All death coming together. Please do not do anything to harm the doll. Get a new house for safety. And this left Mariam's viewers to be very concerned for her welfare and her well-being, telling her not to destroy the doll and not to damage it, but instead just to leave it and move away from the house. Some time passes and Mariam claims to have thrown the doll away. There is no video evidence of Mariam getting rid of the doll, but the following video that she posted explains that she got rid of it. And in the caption to this video, she writes, anyone know what I can do to get rid of this? What the hell? What the, what is that? What's happening? Oh 
But it was this video that I'm about to show you that left the comment section very, very concerned. Mariam's baby is left in the bedroom on its own, and there is some strange activity going on around her. People were left very concerned for the defenseless baby laying in the crib with all this activity going on around them. But the other comments claim that they can see a string that is pulling on all the objects that are being moved. By this point though, Mariam is not just uploading paranormal content to her TikTok page. She's also continuing to upload family related content just like she did in the beginning. With more time passing, more activity is being documented from Mariam's house. And once again, another video that managed to amass an incredible amount of views reaching over 20 million was uploaded when her, her daughter and her son are lay on a bed making a video for the dad. Some strange activity goes on around. Hi, daddy. It's so weird. Just let me go. Ah! Into... Oh my god, no! Ah! Oh, he's okay. Ah! Calm down. He's okay. Calm down. Nothing happening. No, my god. Ah! The follow-up video that she uploads is a video where in her caption she simply writes, I'm creeped out, and with her son sleepwalking during the video. Oh my god, guy, I just woke up and Jacob is not in his bed. And the door, front door is open, and also the door is open where the door was. I'm freaking out. I'm gonna look in for him. I think I know where is he. I think he's in the park. I'm going there. Oh my God, he's right there on the swing. Oh my God, who he's talking to? Oh my God, he's here. Oh my God, the doll is here. Oh no, oh no. Yaku, come on. Yaku, wake up. Wake Mama, up. Yaku, what wake happened? Up. Nothing. It's okay. Why is the door here? It's okay. We're Mom. going home. It's okay. But when she goes over to inspect her son and bring him back home, she discovers something terrifying. Once again though, the comment section were incredibly divided over this video, with a lot of people claiming that the son is acting throughout this video and he is not in fact sleepwalking. And the other people very sympathetic to Mariam and her family's cause. And with all of the activity going on in Mariam's house, she finally decides to take action. With the most popular video uploaded to date with over 81 million views, she brings her father into the house to try and cleanse the spirit that is residing there. The ghost was very active when my dad was cleansing the house. Everything will be okay after this. And for three days after this video, very little was uploaded on Mariam's TikTok page, leading viewers to believe that the cleansing that she had in her house had worked. But on the 26th of September 2022, yet another paranormal video was uploaded, and the entity seems to have come back stronger than what it was before. I think the ghost is back. Activity ramping up, there seems to be a bit of a focus on who the activity is happening around, with her son incredibly present in a lot of the videos from this point onwards. Just like this video, where the son is sat playing video games innocently when this happens to him. <laughs> Later, yet another video that was incredibly popular on Mariam's channel is uploaded. With over 66 million views, the entity within her house has ramped up considerably, with Mariam this time being attacked. What is this? Uh, What's again happening? Uh, I'm making video at the show. Uh, oh. <laughs> And 
As with all the videos that we've seen so far, the comment section were divided with believers and disbelievers, and with the incredible growth that Mariam had received from her videos performing incredibly well, a lot of people started to take notice of the activity in her house. Two pages that spring to mind are The Light Seer and Bishop James Lung, with 214,000 and 717,000 followers respectively. And they both chime in with their opinions on Mariam's videos. But both people seem to be on very different ends of the spectrum. My reaction, unbelievable. This? Oh, this is an acting oh, film. Oh. I've seen you before. They can be there at a show. They're really good streams and more. Unbelievable because it's not real! <laughs> oh, how fun. Blind reaction, the ghost won't even let me clean. Oh, how dare they! What the hell? You're not cleaning that! Oh, okay, okay. So, I watched your videos and I can always find the strings and more. This is. <laughs> can you imagine? Ghost is like, let's pull this up but make it look like it's hanging from a piece of string. Um, I find this family to be very entertaining. Everyone's kind of involved at this point. I've actually had this video sent to me multiple times by other mediums to say, something is definitely going on there. No. Stop it! Grow, please. stop it! I would love to have an imaginary pillow fight with you. Just saying. Oh! <laughs> hey, bring it up! Bring it up! Okay, people are asking me if I think this is a true video or not. It's so hard to tell without actually having more video. Uh, could this be true? Certainly it could. Uh, but I think, from my understanding, she has a lot of activity in her home. She's got to be very careful if this is legitimate. Yet regardless of what people are claiming, whether believing or not, in Mariam's content, she continues to upload the paranormal activity from her house. Just like this video, where once again Mariam's hair gets pulled by the entity within her home. This video that once again caused a lot of concern for Mariam's baby. But four days later, one of Mariam's most popular videos once again is uploaded. In the caption to the video, she states, The ghost won't even let me clean. What the hell? I'm not cleaning that! What's happening? And while Mariam is tidying up around her room with her baby sat in a high chair watching the TV, the baby's toys begin to levitate and move around in front of the baby. But it wasn't until the 23rd of December 2022 that things took a very dark turn, as Mariam uploads a video of her mother stood at the end of the corridor. In the caption, she states, I think the ghost possessed my mum. Mom? 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 You okay, Mom? <laughs> Basically, 
based off of the past videos that people had seen of Mariam's and claiming to have seen strings and faces in windows, the comments section in this video are very unsympathetic towards her claims. Instead, making jokes and poking fun at the video. Over a month passes and Mariam continues to document strange activity from within her house. And on the 11th of January, 2023, she calls her father over once again to try another cleansing Things working, the house. ghost never leaves, so my dad has tried cleansing the house. I hope we will be okay after this. And a few days later, another incredibly popular video with over 72 million views is uploaded by Maria. And in the caption, she states, the baby loves the possessed toy. And in the video, baby is sat on the bed with a toy that is getting pulled away and pulled closer to her and you can hear the baby laughing as it happens. But once again, in the comment section of this video, people are skeptical of what they've witnessed with most claiming that they are able to see the string that is pulling the toy to and from the baby. To this day, Mariam is regularly uploading paranormal based content from her house that are always incredibly popular. But regardless of what you think about Mariam's content, there is no denying that it is insanely popular, with videos often reaching the tens of millions of views mark. But what do you guys think? Is Mariam living in an incredibly haunted house? And should she be concerned for her baby? Or is it after finding a bit of popularity, an elaborate hoax?